Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be learning how we can tell the hybridization of atoms in a compound. So for this first question, here we're asked to identify the hybridization of all the marked or indicated atoms, okay? Now for hybridization, we're going to be looking at just the three main types, which is the SP, SP2, and SP3. The easiest way to identify hybridization is from their bonds, okay? So if you have a single bond, it's going to be SP3. If you have a double bond, it's going to be SP2. And if you have a triple bond, it's going to be SP, okay? So if we use this method, we're going to easily identify these hybridizations in this compound. This carbon here is triple bonded. And since it's triple bonded, this is going to be SP hybridization. This one here is single bonded. It's going to be SP3 hybridized. This here is single bonded. It's going to also be SP3 hybridized. Nitrogen, single bonded, is going to be sp3 hybridized. Oxygen, double bonded, is going to be sp2. This carbon is also double bonded, so it's going to be sp2. And this one, sp2 also. Then for this, you have single bond, it's going to be sp3. This is called cumulated dienes. If you have something like this, the carbon in the middle here, this carbon here, is going to also be sp hybridized. It's not just a double bond. You have more than that. So it's going to be sp hybridized. So take note of that. Although this one is going to be sp2 because you just have one double bond, this one is also having just one double bond. So it's going to be sp2. But well, this center one here is going to be sp hybridized. While, of course, this one will be sp3, and this will be sp3. 